Hi folks, Steve from Martel Training Group. Today I'm going to review a couple of holsters from Hidden Hybrid Holsters. They were kind enough to send me a single clip inside the waistband holster as well as a single clip magazine holster. So we're gonna talk about these products today. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a retired New Jersey State Trooper. I retired after 25 years. I've been carrying a gun concealed for almost 29 years. So I have a lot of experience with leather. This is an old issued off-duty leather holster. It's very soft, nothing wrong with leather. It looks nice when it's shiny and new, but you do have to keep an eye on it. If it starts to uh, degrade on you, you need to replace it. So a lot of experience with leather and here's Kydex. I have a lot of experience carrying with Kydex. What I don't have experience with the hybrid holster. I do want to thank Hidden Hybrid Holsters for sending me these items to try out, review, uh, see what I think, and uh, make a video. So Hidden Hybrid Holsters is a family-owned business based in Ohio. They use local leather workers for the leather part, and we're going to get into that in a little bit. So those of you that aren't familiar with Kydex, it's a thermoplastic acrylic polyvinyl chloride and it's become increasingly popular with concealed carry people because it's heated and molded specifically to your firearm. So of course you can see this is a blue gun, it's not a real gun. Kydex holster, this is a Glock 19 uh, blue gun and this Kydex holster is made specifically, it's molded specifically for uh, the Glock. When I talk about holsters in some of my other videos, I say you need a quality holster that properly covers the trigger uh, area, the trigger guard and the whole trigger area so you can't access the trigger when the gun's in the uh, holster. It should allow for you to grip the gun as well. So they have a proprietary method of making the Kydex part. So it's molded properly to fit your specific gun. So there's good retention there. There's good trigger coverage and there's good uh, sight channel without unnecessary size. They go through several steps of hand shaping, grinding, and polishing so nothing snags on your gun when you go to put it back in the holster or take it out. As far as the leather part of the holster, now this is what's interesting. So I told you I have experience with just leather. I have experience with just Kydex. I don't have experience with until Hidden Hybrid Holster sent me these two holsters. I hadn't had any experience with a hybrid holster. So what's great about this is has all the benefits of Kydex to properly secure your gun. And the other side is leather that goes against your body. But what's specific about Hidden Hybrid Holsters is that it has the suede part on the back leather area. So this is uh, to absorb any kind of perspiration. Uh, it also, to me, I've been wearing this for a couple of weeks now, it keeps it in place, whether it's against clothes if you have an inside shirt or if it's against your skin, it helps to keep it in place uh, uh, in a better way. The leather itself is very thick, so you're not gonna get much uh, as far as uh, movement on the leather, which is very nice. And the stitching is high quality. If you look at the stitching on the leather part, it's high quality. Now, on this particular holster, they sent me single clip. This is inside the waistband for appendix carry. You could also use it uh, three or four o'clock position is where I usually like to carry it. A lot of people use this holster for appendix carry. This accessory on here, they call it the claw. Now you can take it off, there are screws in this. This actually pushes the gun, the, the, uh, the handle of the gun away, back closer to your body, away from say your waistline or your belt to prevent printing, but basically it hides the gun in a better way. So if you're wearing tighter fitting clothes and your gun kind of, the butt of your gun kind of sticks out, you put this claw on here and it actually pushes the gun inside the waistband a little bit more towards your body. If you don't like the way it feels, you can take it off. Very easy to do that. They do offer a 30 day one question return policy. The reason they want you to uh, they have one question for you. How can we make it better? So uh, you can return it and just let them know what you didn't like about their holster so they can try to improve. They make many different types of holsters. This is a single clip inside the waistband, either appendix carry or strong side carry. Uh, I usually carry it strong side. So this is the type of holster that I typically carry. Now this is a blue gun. I do have my 
I do have my SIG P365X here. It is unloaded. You see the action is open. There's no round in there. And the magazine, I will take that out. It's an empty magazine. I have no ammunition here. So just to show you that it fits the actual gun nicely, the retention is really good. To be able to grab the gun, uh, the holster is designed in such a way that it makes it easy to do that. Okay, I've tried this out several times and nothing gets in the way. So the Kydex is thick, the leather is thick, the uh, clips are in such a way that you can tuck in a shirt if you if you want to. They're also adjustable, so if you if the gun is riding too high or too low on your waistband, you can adjust it. There's adjustable retention clips. I mentioned the claw before. You can take this out if you don't like it. If it doesn't feel right or you don't need it, you can certainly just remove it. They also make single clip holsters for the small of the back carry. It's available in multiple colors. So they also have holsters with double clips, which you can use for inside the waistband with the clips or outside the waistband with holes, which will accommodate a belt up to inch and three quarters um, in length. Now I should mention that you need a good quality belt to conceal carry. You can't use a flimsy belt. Hidden hybrid holsters do offer uh, quality belts as well. And they also offer a, an outside the waistband. So if you're gonna do open carry, they offer that type of holster as well. So as far as their magazine or their magazine holsters, they also uh, have single clip and double clip as well inside the waistband, outside the waistband. You can see the one they sent me here. This fits my SIG uh, steel magazine uh, perfectly fine. It's a 12 round magazine and it fits it fine. Again, same quality uh, with the gun holster, the magazine holster. Uh, the Kydex is very thick and the leather on the back is very thick as well. The stitching is awesome and it has adjustable uh, retention and the clips are adjustable. The clips are also replaceable. You can replace the clips. Uh, there are some plastic clips or some metal clips. You can get different uh, variety of clips, but this came with a bag of different hardware to make adjustments as necessary. So it also converts from a double stack magazine to a single stack with the retention screws that uh, are included when you buy the holster. So when you go to their website, if you're looking for a holster for your, uh, for your concealed carry, they have a easy way to put in the make and model of your gun, whether or not you have a light, a laser or red dot system on there because for a small fee, it will accommodate any light laser or optics. So I have to say that after trying these holsters out for a couple of weeks, I really don't see any cons. I know some people say, well, with the leather part, you know, sometimes it doesn't hold the gun in. The whole idea is that the gun's against your body. So even if it was a complete leather holster, the fact that it's in your waistband and against your body would actually hold it in. So, so overall, I'm very happy with the holsters that they sent for me to try out. Uh, they were very comfortable. That's the thing. It's, uh, it's, a lot more comfortable having the softer suede against your body because sometimes uh, I don't use, I don't have it against the shirt. Sometimes it's against just the, on the inside of my waistband and I just have a shirt over so it's against my skin. And this suede part against my skin feels a lot nicer than uh, just plain Kydex. They're high quality holsters. So if you want the benefit of Kydex for a molded fit for your gun, but the added comfort of the leather to go against your body, and it's again, it's thick leather, so it's not gonna really move too much, then you wanna try out a hybrid holster, and I would suggest that you go to Hidden Hybrid Holsters and check out their stuff. They have so many different gun models in their list, in their database, that will, uh, will fit your guns. They have many different holsters depending on your situation and what your requirements are. I'm very happy with these two holsters. I think they're very uh, well made. And again, there's a lifetime warranty on the Kydex part and the leather part. If you like this video, please hit the like button and share it with anyone you think will benefit. Also consider subscribing if you're not a subscriber already. And if you do, hit that notification bell so you know when we release new videos. Thanks for watching, take care and stay safe.